defending undefeated. Max Kellerman dropped that heat, that ether, that shit that make your soul burn slow today on ESPN First Take. Woo-wee! That's what the fuck I'm talking about. Thank you, ESPN, for hiring Max Kellerman. I agree with Max 1,100% what he had to say about Floyd Mayweather not taking risks, cherry picking. See, when I say it, when Keith Thurman said they call us haters, but you can't call Max Kellerman a hater because he's an analyst doing his mother loving job. And I'm going to let you guys hear what he had to say. That shit was pure heat. Nothing but heat. Straight up ether. Particularly in Floyd Mayweather's era, which until he's really, really done fighting, I'll believe it when I, you know, when a couple years go by and he doesn't <laughs> fight. I think we're still in that era. Yep. Um, what he showed was the opposite, was it is exploitation, but instead of letting the fans of the networks exploit us, we are going to exploit the fans of the networks. Point. By not fighting the fight you want us to see us fight and taking all this punishment, by waiting for just the right time to fight just the right guy, when that guy means maximum reward, minimum risk. Floyd Mayweather said between, before the Pacquiao fight, when I say TBE, the best ever, I don't mean in the ring, someone else can have that. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about the whole fight game. And he's right. If you're talking about the way he played the fight game, that's the career you should want. If it's your kid boxing, that's the career you would want was Floyd, Floyd Mayweather's career. But it, it set a bad precedent from fans' point of view for other fighters. Because what it taught other top fighters is avoid risks when they're not worth money, wait until the risks go down and the reward goes up, and then fight. Mm. From our point of view, fans and networks, that's not what we want. We want the Pacquiao model. Go head first into the biggest, baddest challenge. That's why Pacquiao has some losses. So he fought Morales and Barrera and, and Marquez. And, and, uh, and then later on, you know, everyone who's let's, bigger let's, than him. Let's not, let's not forget when you say Marquez. Yeah. Let's not just throw that out there. That's when we learned that Pacquiao, too, takes Ambien. That's when we learned yeah. that, that's you right. know, he was Here with the well, Stephen A., that's what, saying. Okay, but, let's not forget that. Let's not forget you're that. Right, but that's what happens when you take real risks. Muhammad Ali lost. Mm -hmm. He took risks. So what 